everyone, it's Mimi. So today I'm eating like Daisy Keach in hopes that I will have a small waist and a big butt. She has a bunch of what I eat in day videos from like years ago to more recent ones. I'm gonna be going with the one where um she's, it's like her lift day meal because I did do a uh, booty day. I did do booty day and I did do really good on my hip thrust, so. Very on track with her. I'm gonna measure my waist. I don't think anything's gonna happen to my waist in the span of one day of eating like her, but I wanna measure my waist today and measure my waist tomorrow morning and just see like, you know, like a little centimeter would be great, right? A little centimeter towards being like Daisy Keach. I doubt anything will change, but like you never know. So let's do it. I don't even know how to do this. Okay, so we're gonna go around and I got a little bug bite. Let's see. What does it say? A little, it's like 25 and a, li a little over 25 inches. So let's see tomorrow. So for breakfast, in this video she has avocado toast in the making. I have four pieces of baking, baking, bacon cooking right here. My breakfast all together. She has eating disorder allegations left and right. Um, so let's, let's see if this kills me. Let's see if this video kills me and I disappear. Um, but this looks pretty good to me, so. Let's so for it. breakfast, it looks like she has two pieces of turkey bacon, an avocado toast. I have sourdough here. She loves her sourdough and um, some fruit. So I have a Granny Smith apple and blueberries. It looks like she has red apples, but like we're gonna, we're gonna do green apples, okay? And for the turkey bacon, she just throws it in her pan. And I usually just throw mine in the air fryer, but I want to be exactly like her, so we're going to do it on the pan, just like that, with our hands. And then for her sourdough, it looks like she has half a slice. Girl, that's really sad for me, because I would totally eat the whole slice. Um, yeah. Is this a bread knife? No. No, this is a bread knife. Oh, Lord. This is a workout. Oh lord. Oh my god. I feel like my implant's gonna pop out. Oh my. Oh. This is previously frozen, okay? So I'm not being dramatic. Okay. Woo! Got it. Okay, and then we gotta cut this in half, unfortunately. This might even be too thick for her. I don't know. Bye bread. And then the avocado, this avocado, I'm not gonna lie. Um, she's really squishy. So I'm scared about that. Uh, flipping this bacon. Raw dog. Ah! Oh. <laughs> I was raised in a third world country. Yes, I'm using my hands. All right. Let's find out what this mushy avocado if she's edible. It, I cut it and it just deflated. Yep. Anyways. But maybe it's like really ripe, but like delicious, right? <gasps> wow, positive. Arm. She peeled herself. It smells vegetably. I'm not mad at her. Oh, I have to toast the bread. Dirt, 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 dirt. It's edible. It's edible, it's safe. For the fruit, I already have the blueberries out and then this feels super waxy. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna peel it. So Daisy Keach, she is known to eat really little. Um, so I am scared to see if I survive today or not. Um, I think this video, she, I, I honestly don't think that this video is too alarming. Um, this might have been like the, 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 you know, publicity control video. I don't know. Um, we'll get into it a little bit later, but her body, dude, it's, dude, makes me insecure. Like, she just looks so good. I'm like, if she's in a massive calorie deficit, like, maybe that's what I gotta do. 
Everybody's always like calorie deficit is the only thing that works calories in calories out until you see a calorie deficit and you're like Damn, she doesn't really go to the gym like that. It seems like she Doesn't work out like a lot of weights. So maybe like her deficit is just like really tiny I don't know. Maybe I'm just an apologist, but she was like getting canceled left and right back in the day But like y'all asked her how she got that and she showed you we can't be mad, right? Oh my toast is ready. Okay. This is honestly a really good breakfast in my opinion like there's fruit There's avo toast. There's turkey bacon like this does not feel anorexic Is that triggering for me to say that on YouTube? I don't know. Okay, here's my apples and blueberries This looks so good. You know, it'd be so good honey on top of this Mmm this I do have a problem with okay one thing I will say is that um, She talks about cutting out carbs a lot I'm using this sourdough bread and at first it kind of like eating sourdough didn't really feel right to me but then i'm like well if i'm gonna work out these carbs are gonna go to my workout it's going to go to fuel my body so i have energy so i don't think it's that bad and plus i like it and it's enjoyable for me hey if it works maybe it works she does say she only eats bread when she like goes to the gym which is oh i can't agree with her i can't protect her anymore after that one but also like she's a victim of diet culture and like society's expectations of women to be small so don't blame her blame the system oh my god this is so cute stop this is so cute here is the breakfast this actually looks so good and filling and like complete i'm super hungry Mmm, so good. Honestly, I would make this breakfast again. Avocado toast. I forgot how good avocado toast is. And I cannot believe she only eats. That's just crazy. Turkey bacon. Turkey bacon is actually like my top kept secret for weight loss. Um, one of these things are like 30, 35 calories if you find like the good ones. And super high protein, super low in calories, and like pretty high volume. Like it's huge for how little calories it is, and it's so good. Do a low. Mmm. Why is that so good? Oh my god. My issue is, I want more. The toast is so good. Why is the fruit here? I want another piece of toast. I'm just hungry. I'm like, I don't want this damn fruit. I want toast. So yeah, now I'm just eating the fruit. I don't like, it's not that I don't like fruit. I really want toast. So I'm gonna keep munching on these, but I'm not gonna lie, I don't feel full. Like, I don't feel like my stomach is even, like, expanded. I feel like that was, like, bird food. But then I'm also thinking about, like, height and weight. I'm 5'4". I feel like she's around my height. But I, I reckon she's, like, 10 pounds lighter. She's, like, a stone lighter. Um, so... I could see me. Oh, I really don't want the fruit. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, it's good. Um, so I could see like if I was 10 pounds, 15 pounds lighter, like I could see this being like a perfect breakfast. Okay, so I just finished about a shoot, and in between then, in between working out on a photo shoot, I had a protein shake. So I've been starving for the past couple hours and now we're gonna make her smoothie She said that she had a protein shake, but that's so boring So we're gonna make the smoothie of that. I always see her make it my spinach in here So I put about like a half banana cuz you know save those carbs almond milk I fill it to there wait maybe a little more you know what should I just be no no okay some almond butter Maybe like that much. This is what it looks like right now. It looks amazing. So she does almond milk, almond butter, banana, and spinach. I got this like little packet of vanilla almond butter. I love almond butter. Like I used to eat just strawberries, fresh strawberries, and almond butter just like dip it, like heaps of it. 
so good. Back in the day when calorie counting wasn't in my mind. So yeah, now I just go with this little packet that's 200 calories for this whole thing. Would Daisy approve? She eats like spoonfuls of it though. It literally tastes like a little bit more because I love almond butter. I'm pretty happy about this. It looks like she uses quite a bit. Like it like fills up. So I want to say like, I don't know. Ooh. Who knows? A little bit for good luck. A little extra. She does usually like half a banana unless she's worked out. And I'm doing a whole banana because I just worked out. So my muscles... And my body need the carbs to replenish myself. Um, I'm just gonna try the half a banana and see how that goes. I just wanna like, I just wanna feel what she feels. And then some spinach. Um, I don't know how I feel about this. I feel like this used to be like the thing back in the day. Like this was like peak health. I used to do this so much in high school, like spinach smoothie. Like I don't know what was wrong with this. That's what it's looking like. Spinach milk, love that. And then some of this. Almond butter. Oh my gosh, I love almond butter. Mmm. Vanilla. Oh my god. It's so good. I'm putting this entire packet, and I think she would, in fact, approve. Oh my god, no. Hold on. I have not had almond butter in years. Because, frankly, I'm scared of calories. This is the best day of my life. Thank you, Daisy. Oh my god, yum. Let's leave a little extra for mommy. Oh my gosh, this is actually so nostalgic. Like, these spinach smoothies used to literally be like all the hype back in the day, back in like 2017. Like, you know how like juicing became a thing? Before juicing, it was spinach smoothies. Lighting is so bad. Okay, so I don't know how to get the lighting because like down here it's like Ghostly so I have my smoothie and she adds ice. I forgot to add ice So I'm just gonna throw an ice cube in right now and I should have just used like frozen bananas But I forgot so we're gonna have this. Let's try it out mm -hmm. I'm so curious. I have not had spinach in a smoothie in so long literally since high school and that was like three decades ago. Mm. I put so much milk, it just tastes like milk, but like so good. Mm. It just tastes like really creamy. It tastes like almond milk and the almond butter. That's it. Like, sweet, good, delicious. Oh my god. And I'm like hungry, I'm starving, so I'm like chugging this down right now. I got some chicken, salad, and then buffalo cauliflower, vegan. And I'm not vegan, by the way, because there's literally chicken on my plate. But I try to stay away from dairy. Then we got some rice. Which I also probably didn't need because I already have the cauliflower, so that's my carb. I did do booty day and I did do really good on my hip thrust, so. So I've got my food. I'm combining lunch and dinner because it's like so dark out right now. Um, and she eats practically the same thing. She says she eats like rice, chicken, salad. So I'm kind of just combining it and just doing her lunch. Um, so she had cauliflower, buffalo cauliflower, um, chicken and salad and rice. And then I have my white rice on the side. I was looking for cauliflower in the frozen section, like buffalo cauliflower, you know what I mean? A little vegan, it's like her ear one, but I could not find it. So I actually found these. These are jackfruit nuggets which sounds crazy but she loved vegan stuff or like back in the day like she used to love her vegan stuff she used to love her veggie grill so i feel like this was very on brand she would have eaten this up back in the day this is what i'm having um am i hungry yes am i starving yes do i want more yes am i still happy to eat this yes so let's eat it I have my food and I also brought out my spring water. She drinks spring water from Erewhon. I've been a little bit of a spoiled brat with my water and I've only been drinking alkaline water like when I have the option. Obviously like when I go to the grocery store I'll buy alkaline water. Um, 
because it's just better for your body and it's better to keep your body at a higher level of alkalinity that makes sense because it just helps fight off diseases and viral infections and all that scary bacteria so you guys should start drinking alkaline water um there's just been a lot of set not like studies but kind of studies honestly i just kind of like went through the video and saw that she had a bottle in her hand and i thought it was spring water because i've seen other holistic like baddies rave about spring water and so that's what i thought it was but she's talking about alkaline water but she's like oh like there's not really studies done on it so i'm also like well maybe it's good that i didn't buy the alkaline water honestly the spring water thing like i can get by because of the minerals and it's like okay like over purification is bad okay i can get behind that but like alkaline water i don't know about that so i'm also like i don't regret that choice but this is why i'm babbling about something completely different than what she's talking about in this video because i just did not understand and i misunderstood uh aka i didn't watch that part of the video i did watch it with my eyes but i did not listen to her and spring water is supposed to be better than like our purified water because it's not stripped of the minerals it's supposed to make me live forever and make me 10 times prettier or something so Here's my $3 water. I know it's like a big thing to have the water come in glass because plastic's gonna kill you. I don't know. So we're having our very expensive water with our dinner slash lunch. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, the lecture to life. The I don't know. It's gonna cure every disease and every heartache and every mental illness let's see oh feels a little chapsticky mmm so smooth okay yeah that's good it's like yeah um it it's water do you guys think Daisy Keach ever, you know, just pops open a crisp, cold Diet Coke? Because that would be real nice right now. Anyways, okay, let's eat our little chicken dinner. When I want our chicken dinner. Okay, let's try the nuggets. Like, I know this was not part of her thing, but like, jackfruit nuggets? Her vegan era. Like, she would have loved this. Mmm, that's good. This is better than a cauliflower buffalo nugget thing. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm so surprised not many people know about this. Like, this is so good. Only for a spoon for the salad. I don't have any dressing, so I just put balsamic glaze on it. And I got arugula because I like arugula, but this does not look good. Mmm. Delicious. No, it's actually good. I love arugula. And then we have some chicken. I just season it with random stuff. Just chicken. I don't know. She says she had chicken like for lunch and dinner. Delicious. Some rice. We deserve it because we worked out today. Mmm. Oh yeah. Bro, while I was doing research for the video, I was like, chicken, rice, and salad sounds so boring. But honestly, when you're starving like this, this hits. And chicken breast is so good, like, for weight loss, calorie deficit. Like, it's so high in protein and low cows. This hits. Yeah. Or, or I'm just the best cook ever. Oh, my God. Everything's so good. I'm so hungry. In the video, she does her little Air One haul. She said that she got this chocolate chip cookie. A little Air One gluten-free vegan cookie. And I don't think she ate it. Like, she did not show herself eating it. I think it was a publicity stunt because she was getting allegations. During the dinner portion, she did not say she ate the cookie and the juice. Like, I feel like that cookie would have filled her up a little too much for her to have chicken and rice for dinner like i've watched so many of her videos at this point 
her brain chemistry has like infiltrated mine and I think like her now or so I've convinced myself and like this is kind of a lot <laughs> for little old me right now as a little recap I've eaten I've accidentally out dieted her i fear i have out keached the keech i was supposed to eat four pieces of turkey bacon i ate only two and then i've only had one meal that she's had so i'm supposed to have another serving of rice and chicken and i honestly don't feel like i need it which is like kind of crazy um other than what she's eaten and what i've shown in this video i've had like a protein bar and coffee with milk so like nothing crazy but like let's say that goes for the cookie and the coffee she had in the morning and that still makes me i out dieted daisy cage i fear but you know what tomorrow morning's waist measuring might just go crazy then but at the end of the day what i've learned the most is that simple meals are so good and that smoothie was just so delicious and like i can totally have almond butter in a calorie deficit you know so that was really really good for me to see and because i love almond butter and also like what she eats is honestly so healthy and so good for you but it's so good at the same time like i just thought it was so like ah so boring like ah you're eating so little like ah whatever everybody's hating on her i'm like ah like fuck uh, maybe but honestly eating what she eats i'm like this is not a bad amount this is a good amount and it tastes really really good and it's great protein like this is great like she's not doing anything wrong Hello everyone, I just woke up, so I just measured myself, and um, I think it's around like a little under 25, and yesterday I was a little over 25, which is kind of crazy, so it definitely went down, I feel like I, I can tell the difference, um, but honestly, I will start eating some of her meals, and she's kind of onto something. Anyways, this was really, really fun to make, thank you so much for watching, I'll see you next video. Mwah.